Hi everybody, welcome to Cooking with Alex. Last time you saw us, we were uh, making chicken uh, in this same place last winter. This time we've got something special planned. Uh, we have no recipe. The name of this episode is Alex Raids the Fridge. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna raid the fridge and pantry and just take whatever is like lying around and trying to make the uh, tastiest thing possible. What? It's chopped. What do you mean it's chopped? Oh, it's chopped. Yeah, okay, it's a show chopped. I'm gonna try to use only ingredients that actually would be laying around in somebody's house. So stuff that you can make on your own. That's sort of the idea of these videos, is like, if you guys need to eat food, you know, you can figure out how to make it without going to the grocery store. Oh, I should say, I haven't eaten anything today. Um, no, can I look in this camera? Sure. I haven't eaten anything today, nor have I cooked anything today, nor have I looked in the fridge today. So this should be kind of spontaneous. I don't have a plan, um, so we're gonna figure it out. All right, let's go, let's go check out the fridge, see, see what we have to work with. Um, so this is a, this is a pretty well-stocked well, well -stocked fridge. Got a spicy Italian chicken sausage. Okay, this is good, it's kind of pre-made. I'd like to do something a little less pre-made. Um, I don't know what the fuck that is. Beans, oh, okay. So this, this might be cool. So rice, I think most people have like leftover rice in their fridge. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna hang on to that. Blueberries, I mean, we're gonna, we're gonna do like a meal, so. This might be cool. This is like blue rice, and I have no idea why it's blue. Oh, I don't know, if we go with fried rice, who knows? Maybe we'll do some blue rice, some white rice. We even have brown rice here. But I kind of hate brown rice, so I don't think we're gonna mess with brown rice. And then of course you got eggs. Um, you got wine, shout out to the wine moms of Woodbridge. It's cool. These guys, I don't know if you know, you know bean sprouts. I think. I'm starting to lean towards fried rice. This would be good for fried rice. And egg. Dude, maybe, I think we're gonna make fried rice. We have really little soy sauce. That's a problem. You know what, it's not a problem. It's a challenge. Maybe red curry paste? Fuck it, who knows? Who knows, maybe that's going in the sauce. What is this? Verde sauce? Yeah, fuck it, okay. This pepper looks kinda old, but that's fine. Let's we'll put that in there. I'm gonna do coconut oil. This is gonna be crazy. It's gonna get like, yeah, we're gonna do coconut oil. So we got green onion, basil, bean sprout, yellow pepper. Think jalapeno pepper, but it's a really weird looking one. Garlic, shiitake mushrooms, right, uh, blue rice. Fucking blue rice. Don't ask me why it's blue, it's blue. White rice. Um, an egg, fuck ton of sauces. We got green salsa, who cares? Maple syrup, uh, red curry paste, ponzu sauce, habanero sriracha, little bit of soy sauce, fish sauce, white wine vinegar, freaking wine. Okay, so I think right now we're gonna do like sauce time. So I'll get like a little sauce dish, saucy dish. I can keep my sauce. There's not much soy sauce. It's like literally this much soy sauce. So I'm gonna start with this. All right, our sauce is almost finished. Uh, ponzu, I'm gonna put this in here. Uh, this is like soy sauce and lime. Because we don't have soy sauce, we're gonna compensate with this thing. And we're just constantly, we should be, con we should be constantly <laughs> just, just tasting it. You sure it should be that close to my face? I love it. Verde sauce. If it was salsa verde, it should have been green salsa. I feel like verde sauce is just confusing. Uh, we'll throw that in there. Maybe that'll be good. Who knows? This spicy bit. 
Uh, we'll do a little bit of my Uncle Adam's maple syrup. Okay, I mean just, can you get a shot of this stuff? This is just, like, look at this. You've never seen syrup like this. And you can use, you can use normal, you know, normal syrup, you know, normie syrup. But like this stuff, like, oh yeah, okay. We'll do a little bit. You can also do honey if you want to make something sweeter. Sort of up to you. Okay, uh, we don't have much rice, rice vinegar, so I'm just gonna toss in what we have. A good bit of what we have. I can, it could be a little saltier. I'm gonna do a couple of drips of the fish sauce. You know, I'd say this process is like you add stuff that you think will be good, then you taste it, and if you figure out it needs something, then you just add, add that. It's Thai red curry paste. Traditional wisdom says they don't make sense together. Okay, it's not that I have some genius wisdom that says that like, oh, these things turn out to be really good together. The truth is that like most things, generally speaking, are good together, you know? So there are no rules. There are no rules. Oh, fuck it, let's put some wine in it. Cause you know, toss a little bit of this in there. And the wine, wine will probably cook out, but that'll just like add, I don't know, add something. It's choppy chop time. Uh, yeah, I saw a good movie. I saw uh, Once Upon a Time in Hollywood recently. Mm, was it was an excellent movie. What do you think? Um, I don't know. I don't want to give spoilers. Okay, but uh, outside of spoilers, I thought it was really cool. I thought, like, I walked out of the theater being like, like, like what? Like what happened? We're gonna start cooking this shit. Oh. Yeah, I got the I got this shirt in a uh, in a thrift store in, in Providence. It was funny because I was out to lunch at a diner, and uh, we were waiting to get seated. And this woman looked at me and looks like looks me in the eyes and go, "I like your shirt." And I wasn't really sure what to do. And I was like, "Oh yeah, like yeah, I pre appreciate it." And she was like, "Yeah, we totally are." And then I just like wasn't sure what to do. So I looked at her and I was like, "Yeah, yeah, keep fighting," you know. <laughs> try to try to keep a straight face. Right, so we got this uh, got this pan. I'm putting coconut oil in it. So you can do olive oil. You can do whatever you want. I'm putting coconut oil mostly because it just seems interesting. <laughs> um, a little bit because it can take high heat a little better than olive oil. But like olive oil will be fine. Any oil will be fine. Canola oil is whatever. So we're getting this oil hot. Okay. All right, this is hot. It's not that hot, but. So generally speaking, garlic, you wanna, you know, cook while it's kind of hot. You wanna cook garlic early, so. Also, I should say that this thing's on like high heat. Like, this is on like full blast. The coconut oil. I never really cook with this. So that's a first for me. But it can be a first for you. All right, now I'm at the point where I'm comfortable adding the mushrooms. Like it looks like the garlic's cooked a good bit. The mushrooms have a shit ton of water in them, okay? So the business right now is gonna be, I wanna pull as much water out of these mushrooms as possible. So that when I put the rice, the water from the mushroom doesn't like seep into the rice and make the rice all wet instead of crispy. No fear. Fear is a choice. Look how much smaller these mushrooms are. Look at how much they've shrunk. You know, that's because they've lost water. It's great. All right. I think we're at egg time. Eggy, eggy fun time. So I'm gonna move all this shit over this way, right? And then this is gonna be where we cook our eggs. All right, so I like hibachi guys do it, where they just like, they like crack it right in, and then they just sort of scramble it in there, and then they mix it in. You know what I'm talking about? And then we're just gonna go, just gonna do this, this number. 
Yo, what's up? Is God dead? <laughs> and I'm gonna do the sauce now and then the rice. Stuff off the bottom. Okay. Do a little bit of sauce. We'll save some. Oh, put vinegar in there. The whole thing here is just like trying to keep shit dry. Like I don't want this this whole thing to be like real wet. You know, sometimes, sometimes feels like sometimes when you're cooking the food, it kind of feels like the food is cooking you. Good. Oh, I'm sticking in the rice right now. Oh, shit. I'm sorry, I'm sticking in the blue rice right now. Who cares? Let's take. Okay. I'm just looking at this now. I think we need more oil. I want this rice to get like fried. It's supposed to be fried rice, you know. Fuck, dude, it's hot. I keep, I keep forgetting that I put this thing down. <laughs> yeah, blue rice. <laughs> sure. But it looks, it looks good. I mean, like, the color's a little weird. I'm not gonna lie. But it, like, it looks, it looks like a fun thing to eat. Yeah, I'm gonna put the rest of this sauce on it. Which is cool. I think I'm at, I'm at I think we're at tasting stage. Right. Oh yeah, I fuck with this. I totally fuck with this. You can taste the coconut in it, which is great. Very soon we're gonna pull this off and we're gonna add our fresh vegetables. Yeah, it's no longer really blue. Which is, I think, a good thing. Picking these leaves off. Right, this, this feels good. I'm gonna turn, turn the heat off this, okay? We have our basil. I'm just gonna chop it up all choppy. Toss these guys in. And then we toss these guys in. You know, put them in. Okay, so this is like all the shit in the fridge fried rice. I think it should be good. I'm gonna do a, do a last check, last taste. You know? Yeah, it's great. Thanks. Well, yeah. Um, yeah, what is it? What is it? What tell us about? Okay, so in, in this, we have both white and somehow blue rice. Uh, we have... It got sort of mixed mixed in, yeah. It was blue at the time. I don't know why it was blue. It was... I don't really think I've ever had a fried rice like this before. Yeah. There's ponzu. There's ponzu. Good cash. Well, ponzu is a citrus. Uh, a little bit of Adam's maple syrup is in it. Right. You got a sweetness. Cool. Is it a little sweet? Yeah. It's really good. Adam. Hey, can I sign off eating it? Can somebody, can one of you film me so I can eat it and then. I think it'd be cool if you did it, you ate and film at the same time. Okay. What? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, you feed me. All right. So th this has been Cooking with Alex, episode two. Um, Alex makes. Uh, Alex, yeah, some rice on there. Alex yeah, raids, raids the fridge. <laughs> <laughs> um, today we made a coconut, coconut fried rice. <laughs> Noah and Emily seem seem to like it. How is it? You tell us. Oh, it's actually delicious, but it's really hot. Um, More. <laughs> yeah, here we go. <laughs> um, tune in next week. <laughs> tune in next time. Please hit like and subscribe. <laughs> Follow me. <laughs> Find me on Patreon. Um, like, like, subscribe, yeah, actually, comment. Do you have a Patreon? Find me on Patreon. No. Find me on Patreon. 
Like match me on Tinder. <laughs> oh, <laughs> <God>. <laughs> All right, we'll see you next time. <laughs>